Roger. Ready and action. This is the most remarkable restaurant I've seen in all my years in the food service industry, and I've seen it all. I want to hear your story. Here you are. How the heck did you come up with this? Oh, I didn't. We did. Dick McDonald, my brother. Hi. Boy, I gotta tell you, this is the most yes, I smoke this. The McDonald's brothers, what those two boys created, changed everything. This this changed everything. Care for a little tour? Speed! That's the name of the game. The first stop for every McDonald's hamburger is the grill. Manned by two cooks whose sole job it is to grill those all beef beauties to perfection. Meanwhile, as the patty cooks. Our dressers get the buns ready. Watch out. Burger crossing. Mac and Dick McDonald stumbled onto a new system to fix the ills of the drive-in business, essentially, which is what they were in when they started. They're sort of the Henry Ford of fast food. So they developed this choreographed way that food could be made in 30 seconds rather than 30 minutes. We wanted something different, and that's when my brother here comes up with one of his brilliant ideas. Tell him, Dick. Order's ready in 30 seconds, not 30 minutes. And you were gonna love how we did it, Dick. You gotta tell him. The tennis court? Okay. He brings me out to this tennis court, and he's drawn this line, the exact dimensions of our kitchen. Sink on the right, extruder on the left. Extruder. Okay. And Dick is running around with this stick, marking where all the equipment should be. Tuck in. Tony, are you gonna skip the pickles when we're really doing it? Yes. No. No. <sighs> Ketchup! Use your lazy Susan! <laughs> and pickles, and pickle, and mustard! The Speed D system is born, and it's off to the races. And we are an overnight sensation 30 years in the making. Selfie! Okay, we'll play marker. And action! What are you doing? There's time to lean, there's time to clean. Let's go! They didn't just create fast food as we know it, they had to invent all the things that we take for granted that didn't exist back then. So one of the things they did was they created a little machine, like a flour sifter looking kind of thing that they would just push a button and the right amount of ketchup would drop right onto the bun every time. Now, where'd you get those? We made them. Made them? Yeah, custom built. Whole kitchen is. It's a really incredible story because it shows you the excitement of this company at the beginning. And? And what it must have felt like to stumble on this for a businessman like Ray Kroc. A fresh, delicious burger from grill to counter in 30 seconds. What they started, it really created the thing. Except that Ray Kroc saw it and saw the future. You don't seem to realize what business you're in. You're not in the burger business. You're in the real estate business. The McDonald's brothers, their future went about that far. Ray Kroc's vision of the McDonald's future was endless, was boundless. Life better, 